All right, guys, we are back with another exciting episode of Let's Play the Classics. This was a game that I had as a kid. It's Home Alone for the Game Boy. I actually don't even own a physical copy of it. I want it in my collection so bad. But um, it's one of those games that my mom got me when um, when I was younger. You know, my parents were divorced to go to her house. And um, obviously Home Alone was a huge thing back in the day, the movie. And uh, the Game Boy game was the only Home Alone game that I ever played. And I loved it. It's basically a four or five level fetch quest where you pick up as many items as you can and you avoid the bad guys and the traps and then you get locked in the basement and you fight off rats and all kinds of stuff. So let's check out Home Alone for the Game Boy on this Let's Play the Classics live stream rewind. All right, so we gotta start over. No pizza left behind. All right, so we got to drop these off because we're full. Hit the right side of the room. Down the stairs. Bet you nobody says no one leaves pizza behind. Not even the crust where you get slapped. If you get a really good pizza, Crust is sometimes the better part. Isn't that right, Carol Ann? What? If you, sometimes the, the crust is the best part of the pizza pie? No. What? The pizza's better. The crust is sometimes, sometimes good. Oh, that's probably why I'm with you. All right, drop those down the laundry chutes. Why? Because that's where we're supposed to drop them because we're going to throw them in the safe. Bad guys are trying to rob our house. And we're left home alone. Oh no! Ah! You ever seen Home Alone? You like Home Alone? Nah. We should watch Home Alone. Nah. Me. Nah. Would you me? Me. Me. Boop. Thanks for booping me. <laughs> I do prefer mom and pop pizza shops over like big chain restaurants, you know? I'm gonna dump these off. And that'll leave us with three to get so we can be full. We don't have to worry about getting full and having to come back. Yeah. 
Good thing we don't need that cookie. Alright, so we're gonna be plus one, which is nice. There's a key, and in we go. The Woodbury and Retro Game Hunter has appeared out of the backwoods of Tennessee. What is going on, buddy? What'd you say? CM got the grape purple N64, and the trade worked out great. Yes. Yes, it was, uh... You know, you get to a point where you have so many doubles, and they're good doubles. You know, they're Mario's and Mario All-Stars and Donkey Kong's, things like that. But if they're not selling, I had them at two different trade shows. You know, nobody wanted them. You know, it's time to trade them in, get rid of them, and get something that you want. And especially if you're going to trade up and get something rare. Um, and something that you would never buy for yourself. I'd never be able to afford to buy those PS2 games, you know, on my own. So trading them in is a great way to get them essentially for free because the lots that I got those in, you know, have paid for themselves. So those games are, are free with a little bit of work, you know? And that's sort of the thing now, is if you're not afraid to do a little bit of work and grind a little bit, hustle a little bit. You see how that far he hit me? Get out of here. You know, nowadays you gotta do a little work, you know, you gotta buy a huge box and keep what you want and sell off the rest and whatever's left over is you know, you get your money back and whatever's left over is your doubles, you know? And that's all free, so that's all profit. Yeah, hard to find for sure. And, you know, like, I've already said it, but, you know, I would never spend that kind of money on a PS2 game, you know what I mean? So tomorrow, I'm thinking about taking all of my GameCube commons in there and seeing what I can get from my GameCube commons. done that wrong. No. Okay. All right. Well, that was right. Cool. Cool. You know, I carry seven. What's that? Tight says why uh Woodbury says why tight why is the club on so late? Talking about the uh the Xbox club. We don't need it, but we'll take the points. I don't know if you can get an extra life by points in this game. I think it's just by the pizzas or if you find a pizza box. There's a couple of them. All right, we'll drop those off. Yes, Tight has a very rigorous work schedule. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. 
Empire. Nope, just go. Yep, yeah, that's what I figured. We're gonna have to unload these. Back in there. Okay. Like two or three pieces of pizza. Tell you what, we're gonna run this back because that will make it an even 14, and we can hold seven at a time. We can hold seven and then dump them, and then we won't have to worry about having to go back a second, second or third time. We can pick up seven, drop them down the laundry chute, and then pick up another seven, and drop them down the laundry chute. With 15, I'd have to go back three times instead of two, you know? Where did this pillar of the community thing come from? I think it's something you guys just made up. Sounds like a made up word. Baseball. All right, so there's three. I have a pillar as well. Am I, is that a good thing or a bad thing? I'm not sure what that even means. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, this bald guy. This bald guy tried to abduct me. No. Running close. Yeah, we got a water pistol, 50 slingshots, and six baseballs. Did I say that? <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh. What did I say? Is this guy gonna come after me or what? Cock story. I'm a great thing. Hey, I appreciate that, Wood. All I remember is I was trying to tell uh, Captain Retro because, like, you know, he sold his collection, which is amazing, man. I don't know if I could do that. What I was trying to, like, say was, like, 
you know, it's cool to have some of this stuff, but it is just stuff, you know what I mean? Like, Little Samson, your cool little copy of whatever your rare game is, your Little Samson or whatever it is, you know, you can't take that to the grocery store and trade it in for groceries to feed your family, or it's not going to save your life in a zombie apocalypse, so it is just stuff. Shouldn't be as attached to it as I am. But I think, you know, what I was telling him was that it's not really the stuff. I mean, it, it is. Don't, I mean, don't take that out of context, but it's really the work and the hunting that you put in to find this stuff is the hardest part to let go, you know? Come on. That's the hardest part for me to um, get over mentally is that, you know, the, the, the effort that you put into getting all this stuff. Yeah, it was a, I think that was a deleted scene, Dean. The the wet bandit that walks real slow, is bald, has a tattoo on his left arm. Or the uh, wet bandit that throws his hat at you. All right, wait for this guy to come step on our trap. Jump these off, and we've got three more, four more. Might be a weapon item or a piece of pizza up this way, so we're gonna try and get it. Nope. Thought for sure there was something on there. Oh yeah, absolutely. Well, that's what I'm talking about. You know, I, I love going to the yard sales and finding stuff and reselling it, you know, and knowing that I made a little bit of cash. I've been thinking, you know, I just traded retro heck my, um, did we miss a door? My TurboGrafx-16, I thought, you know, I never play it. He really wants it, so I'll trade it to him. And I got a whole slew of like master system games and stuff. I'm like, I don't need those anymore. So I'm probably gonna look at selling my master system stuff after I do my collection video for it. Is there another door? Are we missing something here? Oh, derp. Hey, free cookie, we'll take that. Take a free cookie, everybody loves a free cookie. This guy is so slow. Better stop screwing around here. The reason this game takes so long is because of this back and forth nonsense. We're going to find out where the trap is on the floor and lure all these guys over to the trap. Kevin should have a BB gun right off the bat. Because that's how it was in the movie, damn it. Really? Really? 
don't know why that guy's there. I thought we got rid of that guy. Isn't this magical? I like how he bends over, spreads his cheeks, and then falls off the screen. It's magical. It's a magical moment. Gotta be something up here. There, slingshot. Yay! The slingshot. Did we miss an entire room somewhere? Alright, this is the main, this is the starting room. Pizza pizza? Hmm, so it's gotta be upstairs. Yeah, Linda, I can't, I can't find it.
locked himself in the cellar again. Again! Alright. Over to the water gun. If you can get it in rhythm, you can just go. Like that. Damn it. There we go. Your red metal tape. He's <laughs> never had text max. Oh, God, okay, here we go. Send tight on a world tour. All right. Okay, okay, doke. 42 electronics. Game Boy and a pizza. Look at that. That was a productive room. off the screen. See, now we're learning. Yeah. 
one time I don't need a cookie. I get a cookie. Hey, a pizza. We better go dump these uh, items off. We can only carry one more and then we're full. should be doing is we should be leading these guys over to that's what we were doing last time save the uh oh man okay just take them out then i guess but that's the next level they ain't forgetting stuff already because i'm old Another room. Oh, okay. We'll head upstairs. We'll see what's up. drop these off please be one close by all right there's one One, two, three, maybe four pieces of pizza. Okay. Four pieces of pizza will earn us an extra life. Oh, there we go. I'm one up. Oh, come on, that was, that was cheap. Cheap! All right, let's go back and dump these, because there'll be six, and then we can carry as many as we need. We're going to carry eight, so that that's we're only going to need six. That's some serious mash skills.
We make it go all the way back and do that, even though we want that that cookie so we can have the extra hit point. Damn it, game. It's good to know. Uh, what's taking up? All right, Wood, take it easy, man. Thanks for stopping by. drop this bad boy off so we're gonna be plus two on this level which is good down the stairs in the cellar Hard to gauge that. It's such a weird angle. Uh. Guess if we had to take a hit, we'll take a hit there. There we go. Kind of want to get him in one of these. Hmm. 
All right, the old BB gun. Let's see if we can do this right this time. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna spawn an enemy, and we gotta run all the way to the right and jump on that box. That looks pretty good. Knock him out. Cookie and a dog. Now over here, get the baseball out, which is good. I need to hit this guy. Boom. Run over, set the trap. Go, go back. Hit the gecko. Gordon Gecko. That was close. Roaming Dan, what is going on, man? Another close one. Okay, so now we don't have to go back to the left. We've got everything we need. I don't have to do the old back and forth. I always check up here, even though I know there's nothing in there. Like, I don't, it's just force of habit. I want to take these back and drop them off. Ah, uh, Dan, yes, we are. Dean is right. We are playing Home Alone for the Game Boy. It's one of my childhood games. I've always wanted to beat it. I've never beaten it. There's only four levels. Okay. Now we start this parade of... Getting all these guys to walk over and step on this trap. This takes forever. Yo, yeet! Looks like we need a couple pieces of pizza and we can get an extra life, which is preferable. a chance we will drop off our pets that'll leave us 49 so not too shabby Krillian 64 what's going on man uh, yes pizza hey there's a one up Good. Drop off nine. Niner. 
You're calling from a walkie-talkie. Shots will clear out the basement here, the middle floor. I think I, I remember. Do you guys remember what I said? We want to go to the top floor or the ground floor. I'm not gonna sit there and learn that pattern. Tell you what, we're gonna go back and we're gonna drop these off. That way we got a clean, clean buggy. Make sure we don't step on any of our own traps. There we go, okay. I can't remember, oh, do you guys remember if I should go up or down? I said, that I should go... I think we go up. I think that's the path of least resistance. Switch over to the... Uh, anything back on the... playing very conservative right here down phoenix what's going on buddy how you been man i haven't caught your channel in a while Hope things are going well there's gonna be a guy guy behind a guy those off there we're on the hook for 32 32 more <laughs> that was a you know, see CM retro but anybody's free to answer right, we have to remember that the room with the triangle things on the wall the room to the right has a trap okay That's a tough one to get. You gotta do that one like absolutely perfect. Back to the slingshot. I know there's got to be a guy. So we're going to go dump these. Watch out for the trap. The room with three, three triangle, triangle, three diamond pictures. There's a trap to the right. Now all we need to do. work this a little bit so we can get that gecko to come up so we can get it oh pizza no pizza left behind that's a rule oh come on
Gonna keep him moving and he won't stop. Go, there's a pizza. Go up the ladder. Yeah, this is going to be tough. We only have one hit to give. I don't think any of these weapons take out a bat. <laughs> Alright. That guy goes all the way up there. Okay, okay. Nah, see, you get too close. Problem is we took that we took that one hit from that guy when he dropped stuff when he stomped his foot and dropped stuff off the ceiling. But we're getting close. We clear out the attic. We should be in. He's trying to uh, save all of the pets down Phoenix. They had to make they had to make the levels somehow. So the first level he's trying to save the valuables. Second level he's trying to save all of his toys. The third level he's trying to save the electronics. And the fourth level, he's got to save all the pets. Which, there's 70 of them. So, like, who has 70 pets, man? That's brutal. Can you imagine the smell in a house if you had 70 pets? Pizza slice. We gotta try and remember as if there's a cookie or something up here. That way, if we end up in a bad spot again... I don't want to try it. Oh, okay. Let's just get out of here. There we go. That's what we need. That rifle. An extra rifle. It's excellent. We've already cleared out all these. Okay. All right, let's pause. Let's read it. Don Phoenix says, well, they do have a big house, didn't they? Yeah, their, yeah, their house was huge. Yeah, bats in the attic. What the dad did for vacation. I say, I say male, male prostitute, man. Shaking it. Downstairs, you get 99 slingshots. Oh, oh, we got a, we got a power up item here. I'm just gonna run through and take them all out. I don't know what that is, but that's awesome.
need some more of those power-ups. bathroom right okay so we just came from there drop the cat down the laundry chute That's the three. And get out of there. Slow CVC, what is going on, John? How you been, man? It's good to see you. It's been a while. Hope things are going well for you and the fam. things on the west side yes yeah, cvc's in the xbox club now do you have to have an xbox one to be in the xbox club are there league dues in the xbox club Jumping? Wait, how, how do we get that? Come on, little doggy. That'd be excellent. If we can get this dog, then we would only need one more. trouble if we can't figure that out. Alright, let's take these back and dump them off before we do something really dumb. Like, jump on the spikes. What's going on in the comments section? You can have a 360? I have a 360. Can I be in the club? Richard Nobody says, yeah, I got that. I just don't play anymore. Dan says, a lot of thrifting during your vacation. Down Phoenix, are there any items that can be used as platforms? Uh, sometimes. Sometimes. It just kind of depends on where you are. I think I'm going to go back. I'm going to see if I can get that dog to chase a baseball. Okay, so we'll switch over to a baseball. Of course, this is the wrong room. Uh, 
Aha! A great a success! And now we gotta figure out what we're gonna do. Okay. That, I have a feeling that if I can get this guy out of this cage. Oh no, you dirty dog! But there is another room. I like our odds. I like our chances here. There it is. Look at that. Alright, so there's a pizza. Now we're gonna be plus one on this level if we get back. Look at that, look at that, look at that. We plus two. There you go, you can steal my one cat. I just don't want to get, I don't want to take a hit. Take a hit, lose a life. All right, so we'll drop that off. Now we're at plus three. Just don't die. Getting back to the basement door. We got the spikes here are going to be the biggest challenge. Right here. Ah, uh, see, we almost overjumped it. Okay. I don't think there are any more floor traps on the way back, but we're just going to be careful. Alright, we are in. In like Flynn. Stand up for a second, I'm gonna get some more water. Talk amongst yourself. So this is this is the chair that I'm sitting on the live stream. Not comfortable. I took a a pillow to protect my tuchus. Okay. Yeah, I'll catch up on the comments. We're going tag team hunt. Is all uh, tight. All you guys play on the Xbox Club is Call of Duty. Is that all you guys play, or do you guys play the other games? Because I don't really like I don't really like Call of Duty. Or first-person shooters. Okay. Ah, see, it's like tri I had that's tricky. Okay. We can jump, 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 and jump. We can jump over those. Jump over this one, retreat. How are you supposed to get that? Really? Oh, come on. Okay, jump, jump, jump over those, jump, jump, duck retreat, jump. Ugh, that is brutal. Run! Okay, you little punk, nobody beats the wet bandits twice. I still owe you for that nail in my foot and BB in my face. All right. Oh, 
Oh, we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. Okay. Now what? Pizza box. We got a one up. Okay, kid. You want to play rough? I got my. When I get finished here, your own mother won't recognize you. Wow, that's that's mean. Scream by the windows. Ain't nobody around to hear you. Okay. So the goal is to open the window and... Oh, it's the dude with the shovel! I gotcha. Okay, this is gonna be a process. Alright, so we go over here. I see, okay, so there's a little bit of a delay, which kind of makes it a problem. Yeah, this looks like our best bet right here. Oh, there's a cookie there! It's tough. Well, we want to. Looks like our best bet's the far right one. It seems like a good one. Hmm. Okay. over uh, as I said I was trying to hit it while I was jumping because sometimes you can do that with the drawers oh we got him We gonna get an item? We gonna get like a one up? Okay. Pause it. All right, CDC says you gotta go back to work. Okay, man, T take it easy, man. If you get to stop by back in uh, later, say hi, man. It's good talking to you. Good to see you. Don Phoenix says Joe Pesci sprite looks like Denny Trejo in a trench coat. In the safe it goes. Hmm. Well, I guess that about does it. Did we win? Chuck another one up four. Dot dot dot. Kevin. Oh, here I knew. I knew there had to be something. The old furnace. We hit it with something else? Or long range weapon? No. Come on. 
Could have taken a couple stabs out there. Run! You just don't have the range. The range on the squirt guns. Okay. Well, there we go. That's what we're waiting for. We get it? Yes! I did it! That's what it says. I did it. That's awesome. Showed that furnace who's boss. Now if only my family could wait. Mom? Dad? Is that you? Oh, sweetheart. I'm so very sorry. That's okay, Mom. Did anything happen while we were away? Oh, nothing I couldn't handle. And the web bandits are in jail. The end. We did it! We beat a childhood game that we had never beaten before, so... It says the end. That's it. Oh, I'm pretty happy about that. We're going to add it to the list right now. Ah. I have a list of games that I have beaten in 2018. I can't believe it's not like a credit screen or something. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Down Phoenix. I, uh, I've been working on this game for, I don't know, a couple days, you know? And I never got past that part in the last sort of dungeon where you got past the, uh, the, the furnace flying pieces. That was pretty tough, but yeah. So, let's go back to the main menu. I'm very happy about that. It's one of the only, only couple Game Boy games that I actually want to own physically or the games that I had when I was a kid. And this was certainly one of them. I remember playing this game, you know, at my mom's house. We got to, you know, my grandparents get in the car. This would be one of the games I played, this and Batman and, you know, Tetris Alleyway, Mario Land, that kind of Revenge of the Gator. If anybody remembers that pinball game. So, all right. Uh, let's go right back to the main menu. That's awesome. I wish to be.